Hey, it's Dave here, Hammond Motorsports, Dirt Car USA. Uh, just got the old chariot out here getting it washed off. Uh, one thing I wanted to kind of give a little helpful tip to, as you see I got the radiator out. Uh, really important to clean your radiators. See here I got this aluminum tank and I've submerged the radiator in it. And I've got the radiator cap on it hoses on it and um, I filled the inside of the radiator up with with water and then we're just going to let it sit there for 24 hours and as you can see already how the crap is starting to flow out of it very important don't take a garden hose and spray through there or blow air that's a good way to clog the fins up and then it isn't going to cool worth a damn um, what I like to do is We'll take this radiator, got it being cleaned, and I will put a brand new radiator in the car. This one then will become the spare. And that way we have them in rotation. I like to let them soak for 24 hours, then let them dry for at least, at least three days. Really let them good and dry before I use them. And then uh, another tip that I always like to do is I'm out here in the country, so I got well water. Don't use that shit. Uh, city water is just as bad, so make sure you get some good distilled water. And then um, I like to put some anti-rust inhibitors in there, water wetter, stuff like that. And uh, really, just when you have your radiator out, come in, really inspect your fan good. That's one of the original diesel fans. Abilene Radiators has got a very good one just like it. I'll be switching to and just make sure that your pulleys are good Check that stuff. I like to run the AN fittings on the upper and then uh, You see that I got the mandrel bent and then the straight hose there. So It's a system that I've been using since like 94 with absolutely no problem. So Anyway, just want to give that little hint tip for you guys that are racing and might be struggling with some heating issues. Very simple thing just to take care of. So uh, anyway, just want to thank everybody for watching my videos. Please like and subscribe to my YouTube channels. Watch me on Facebook, Instagram, and I guess we got some TikTok crap too now. I don't know what the hell this world's coming to, but got to be in all the social media stuff. So, but anyway, everybody... Take care and thank you.